It's fine. Um, yeah, it's hailing. I feel like I- The hail doesn't look too big though. Here. I'm gonna- I might just touch up my car. Yeah. <laughs> Texas, spring. UNT has a tornado shelter. UNT should use like the bathrooms and stuff. They should have, they don't think, I don't think they have like a full tornado shelter. Yeah. Okay. I'll tell my students that. Okay. It chilled out a little bit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I started talking and like right when it was super, super loud. <laughs> so I was like, well, there goes, there goes that. So hi. Hello. Night before last, I got an hour and a half of sleep because it was comeback day yesterday and it was really really fun uh, and today we are getting Korean barbecue Anthony, Samantha, Ryan um, and hopefully Tanner if he gets off work in time but uh, it's more important he gets off work tomorrow for Game of Thrones uh, why did I choose now to do this? because I wouldn't have done it if I didn't do it now when I am sleep deprived and emotional yeah, I don't think I would have done that. I think I would have just been still stuck in the loop of... <sighs> of ugh. Just ugh. I don't want to be there anymore. I want to make things. I want you to make things. Um, that's what I want for you. I want... Because everyone's always, you know, searching, googling, like, things of how to make their films better and better and better. And I because we want people to watch them, like we want to be successful. And those are all, I think, separate goals from what I mean of like, oh, I want to create something to convey like my feelings. That's a very different goal from creating something that's um, meant to, you know, be successful. And some people equate, you know, success with uh, creating emotions in people uh, you know, and I, I don't mean that I want to create emotions in people. Like, that's not what I, like, that's what I'm doing. I would be conveying something that, you know, it's their emotions, obviously. Like, that's how film works. You, but I, I, I'm not going to be, like, researching with the intention of, like, What's the, what am I trying to say here? Like, that's what I'm doing. It's like, I would be, have feelings, I would put them into a creation, and when someone else watched it, like, we hope they have the same feelings. Um, and that's what we really, like, try, when we're trying to define, like, successful art, like, that's how I would define my art being successful, that someone has felt how I felt about it. And they're not super grand feelings. Uh, a lot of them are just like, I had a really good day because of the rain, you know, or something like that. And it's pretty or because I listened to a fun song, you know. It's the little things like that that when I was little, that's what I wanted to convey. So it's, it's a little different than people who want to talk about loss or like, you know, big love stories or things like that. Same and different. And I want you to, find, to achieve your goals, but I want you to be able, I want, you to, I want you to be able to achieve your goals. And this was me talking to people who are letting their worry that they're gonna fail at conveying what they're feeling stop them because you making something is you expressing yourself and you're not going to get any better by sitting there and not doing it at me <laughs> and being fussy and sad because I've been you know starting project after project trying to make things and something keeps coming up and that's better 
than me being fussy and sad and not making things like the past couple weeks because because I'm down because things aren't being made. I need to keep learning because I wouldn't want you guys to give up. I wouldn't want you guys to get down. And that's a big thing about being nice to myself that I have to learn is I would I wouldn't want someone else feeling this way. What would I say to someone else and what would I do for them? And yeah, it's been a wild couple weeks. I have a lot of feelings. I have a lot of emotions. And in this moment, I'm still absolutely terrified to do the next thing that I want to do. Cause I'm not entirely sure how to do it. It's outside my comfort zone because cause it's it's, uh, yeah, because I'm trying, you know, trying new things since other things that I've been trying aren't working. <laughs> I gotta keep trying new things, and I'm getting more and more outside of my comfort zone. I can't let that stop me, because I got ideas to make. I got feelings to convey. I have a lot of feelings today. <laughs> so yeah, that was long. That was a long talk. I feel a lot better, and I hope you even with the camera shutting off and my sporadic brain that I've conveyed my emotions to you in some way and my feelings and my hopes that you make your art and tell people who, you know, you make your art and when you're talking to other people about maybe making their ideas better or maybe moving on to a different idea, you phrase it in a way that doesn't tell them not to make their story of like, oh, here, make this story and we'll make it better. That's always better than like, oh, I don't know about that idea because you need this money, this money, this money. Like, encourage them to write it out, encourage people to follow through, watch how you say things because that, like, that roadblock is dangerous and it just leads to not making things. And our goal is to make things. Yeah, so my three things from before, those are like, me and what I want to do, but yeah, our number one goal is to make shit, which is why I feel bad I haven't had any products to show you, but this, this is a product too, I'm realizing, because it's, I'm, I'm conveying my feelings to you just in a different way, and that's why I kind of don't like this talking to camera. Set up, uh, it's not my first choice, I mean, like, I like it, but it's not my first choice of, like, art because it's not how I want to convey it but man this always feels nice like getting like talk to talk to you and then hear from you it's so yeah uh, now that I'm properly emo I'm gonna grab food and we're gonna do merch inspirations <laughs>